Hey guys, it's Amy from Paper Crane Wishes and today I'm going to show you how I use these resin molds to create some amazing mirrors. If you want this resin mold, you can check out the links in my description below uh, to the Amazon listing that I bought it. It's from Let's Resin. I'm using the Colourpour Crushed Gold Glass. One of the molds has bees in it to make it kind of look honeycomb. So what I did is I filled it with crushed gold glass and here I am I'm just putting a regular epoxy layer uh, of my resin that's already been stirred and I'm going to put some alcohol inks in them that are also color pour. All the products that I use you can see in the links of the description and I just put a couple dots and created just a fun little design that kind of gives these fun swirly effects that can make it really fun and they actually just dry directly like that so once we finish the project and we unmold it you'll be able to just see how beautiful these can actually turn out with the swirl effect with just the alcohol inks pretty amazing and then I used two different colors for the honeycomb one. I used a light blue and a dark blue. These came in the kit that I got for my resin painting a couple weeks ago. So I have the light blue and I thought it'd be cool to kind of create an ombre look. I did want to get something yellow, but I figured that I'd just get the dye pigments for this and just use them all up while I can. Uh, I also am using these to work on my ocean resin painting that you can see in the corner over there to the left. I'll be having that video posted soon. It's turning out so beautiful and I can't wait to show them for you guys. So here I am. I just stirred them and I actually finally found some silicone cups that I didn't buy from any brand. I simply found a silicone baking uh, for cupcakes and I, I cut it up and those are now working fabulous for my silicone cups that I need for any of my resin crafting. So we've got them all in there and then I simply took my American Crafts heat gun and I love doing that because it gives you the opportunity to kind of organize where the shades are going and what direction the patterns of maybe the dyes or the inks that you have. Not to mention it also obviously helps get rid of a lot of those air bubbles but it's so fun to work with the alcohol inks and to kind of just see how it can change just with the heat gun alone. And here we get our final product. Look at that. You can see how the swirl effect, even though I put a mirror in it after all of this, it creates that cool look with the alcohol inks. Isn't that neato? And it, I loved how this piece turned out. I almost thought I'd just use it for a trinket disc, but then I decided I wanted to use the mirrors. The mold from Let's, Let's Resin also comes with six different molds or six different mirrors, excuse me. And you can pop those in and create some amazing presents to give to people or just to keep for yourself. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button be sure to hit that notification bell to be notified anytime I go live I usually go live on Sundays just to hang out and craft but thank you so much to each and every one of you for subscribing we are now at 1.2 K subscribers couldn't be more grateful and I will see you guys next time and remember no matter what anybody says you are beautiful